All right, today we're doing a fitment on a 2023 Mercedes GLS 580. Uh, this bracket will also work on the GLS 450. It's a side profile and it's gonna go center right up underneath there. All right, so it's going to mount up underneath the center here, and because there's no fasteners, we have to you have to line it up. So you want to leave your front plate on and use the double-sided tape to help get it lined up. So that's what we're going to do now. So go ahead and take the double-sided tape off. All right. So. All right. Back to line it up. Back to line it up. So you're going to make sure that surface is clean underneath so that the double-sided tape will stick. You're going to want to line it up, first of all, center. So if you can find a landmark to line it up by. So that looks pretty good there. And yeah, left and right looks good. Just about a quarter inch off the bumper. So I think that's good. Then you're going to want to remove your front plate and get your drill and you're going to want to drill uh, some eighth inch pilot holes there. We'll do the back first and then we'll double and we'll put the single screw in the back and then we'll double check our alignment because then we can make any adjustments we need to make. That's going to be a 6.3 by 20. And you'll need a 10 millimeter socket for that. Okay, flush, then either go quarter to half a turn, you'll kind of fill the resistance, and that's it. Now we'll put the front plate in and kind of verify everything before we drill the two front holes. That looks good. Okay, so now we're gonna drill the front holes. Same process. Run it down till it's flush and a quarter to half a turn. Last one. Flush. Order to half turn. And there you go. And then you take it off, go ahead and put your license plate on it, and when you're ready to go, line it up, pull the pull pin, and slide it till it locks into place. That, and then you're done. We're going to now show you how to mount the license plate to the uh, front bracket. You're going to take your plate, take the screw, put it through the plate, then line it up on the bracket like so. Put the nylon lock nut on it. Now the nylon lock nut will have a nylon ring and then no ring so the ring goes to the outside. So when you put it on make sure the ring goes to the outside. And then you just repeat for the other three screws. And then take your 10 millimeter socket or wrench, if you have just a wrench, fill up a screwdriver and just tighten them up. There we go, last one. Again, these don't have to be super tight because the nylon lock uh, ring in there is going to keep it from rattling off. So there you go. That should, should look like when you're all done.